drop James White. This is probably the craziest transaction of the entire week, but just hear me out for a second. Now on Sunday, White was pretty much used solely as New England's third down back. When you look at the team's snap share report, it does show that he played more snaps than both Sony Michelle and Rex Burkhead. But a lot of those snaps came on the Patriots' final drive when they were in catch-up mode. In the end, White finished with seven targets and two rushes, but three of those targets came on that final drive. In other words, if the script had not been negative for New England, we might not have seen a whole lot of James White against Pittsburgh. And that's my fear that I have with him in week 16, because New England's hosting Buffalo and they're a 13-point favorite. The likelihood that they'll have some of those hurry-up moments is pretty small. But not only that, it's not like James White is performing at some level that we saw earlier in the season. Not even close. Over his last two games, he has a combined 65 rushing and receiving yards. And since Rex Burke had returned from injury, White's seen his snap rate drop by about 20%, while his touches per game has gone down by 4 he has not been productive, and there are a ton of usable running backs out there thanks to injury, and I do think that a lot of them have more upside, more weekly upside, than James White does right now.